of those folks is becoming extremely cynical about humanity, about our country, about maybe the world itself. And it's encounters with people like Mary that are the anecdote or the antidote to that kind of cynicism. So live into her legacy. Give away the best of who she was, but even more importantly, let it inspire you to live into the best of who you are, to discover and develop and share every gift you brought into this world, to do your best to give yourself away. And one day when you pass, a small circle of people that will only represent a tiny fraction of those you have touched will gather together and celebrate all the ways you left their lives richer. And one who will be cheering from a seat in the heavens will be your mother, your mother-in-law, your grandmother, your great-grandmother, your neighbor, your friend. And she will be one of those standing with the one who has always loved you as you are greeted and beckoned home. Well done, good and faithful servant. Now come and receive the reward prepared for you in the beginning of time. May she rest in peace. May she know that she has truly done well. And may she, in what seems like a blink of an eye to her, greet all of you and welcome you home. And may that time in your life be a span of years and years over the course of which you are inspired by her life and her love. I invite you now to, to stand, if you will, and to join us in singing the other hymn that's printed on your insert.